how to change primary market in Shopify. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I am going to show you how you can change your primary market within Shopify. It is very easy and very simple. All you have to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is right here to visit Shopify.com. Then you need to connect to your account or your store. Here we have the admin dashboard as you can uh, consider. And now the next thing that we need to do is to click on products. Within the products, within here, we need to add the product. Add the product, this is the first step. Then when you finish adding your products like that, you're going to head over the settings. Within the settings, we are going to see here markets. And here, as you can see, I have a primary market which is uh, right there set to this country. So if you want to add the USA as a primary market, you're going to set it right here. So go ahead and select the USA or add a market. For example, I'm going to set a market and for that we are going to remove this market because I have only the right to create three markets. Click on add market and then we are going to set a name to it. For example, Europe. Europe like this or we are going to set France, for example. And here we need to search for France. Now I'm going to see the uh, continent or right there we have it. So I'm going to select maybe the France, click on add to market. And right there we have the France added and uh, it is active. Now how we can set that to the primary market, we're going to click on more options. And here below the edit market, we have the choice to make it primary market. Click on confirm. And here we have it. The France right there is the primary market. And how we can set the USA, it is the same thing. We're going to click on right there on make primary market within the uh, more actions. Then click on it and here we have it. It is set to primary market again. You can also add some locations to that specific uh, Shopify store. And this is the location to set the uh, let's say the supplement or the inventory stock like here we have this shop location i can add something else like a shop location for example we are going to use any of these for example countries and set it for example i am going to add into france since i have added it so we can go ahead and set the address the postal code the city and the phone when you do that you are going to set for example the paris paris like this and set save now we have added a location and that location will work in the same time with the markets so we will have a lot of trust within our clients that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you soon on the next one